Hey guys, welcome back to World Snooker Championship 2005. I bet you weren't expecting this back on the channel. Um, I'm just going to turn that game volume down uh, just for just for this little bit uh, here because it is very loud music. But uh, yeah, I thought we'd bring it back in preparation for the new game coming out next year, World Snooker Championship 2019. Uh, I cannot wait for it, and uh, and hopefully you guys will look forward to it too. But uh, we're playing Matthew Stevens in the semi-final of the World Championship. The other match uh, has probably already finished, so let's go and have a little look at that. Um, yeah, Ronnie O'Sullivan is out. Mark Williams uh, has, has won that, so he's in the, the World Championship final. World champion in real life, funnily enough, and uh, we'll possibly be playing him in the final if we can get past uh, Matthew Stevens, the Welsh Dragon um, who got the final in Welcome to real the life in 2005 Here they come then the players enter centre stage for a crucial match Ladies and gentlemen your appreciation please for Joe Ladies and gentlemen, he's the former United Kingdom champion and former world finalist. Let's welcome Matthew Stevens. It's his break. I wonder what he can do. So here we go then. Matthew Stevens with the first break of this best of 33 encounter. We'll be doing each mini session. So four frames per episode. He needs to get the cue ball back to the bulk to be safe. It was a shame not hearing uh, John Virgo's voice throughout the UK Championships this week. Um, it was the same last year, actually. Uh, he didn't do the UK's last year, but came back for um, the world. He, I think he did the, the Welsh Open as well. Um, and think he did the masters can't uh, i can't quite remember but uh, by putting the cue ball safe john virgo and dennis taylor are by far the best commentators <laughs> don't care what anyone says <laughs> oh. it's a risky one to take on early on in this match but we're looking to get on the yellow you know it's first to 17 so you know he's got a little bit of leeway i guess so we'll take on this long red uh, to try and open up our account. Oh, it's a good one. It's a cracker. That's worth the entrance fee alone. Yeah, lovely pot there. Be just fine if the cue ball doesn't miss. Just didn't quite come out, come back enough for the uh, for the black. I mean, in real life, you'd you'd play safe here, but I'm going to take on the blue because you know Matthew Stevens would if. Uh, if he was in this position, so if he's taking those sorts of shots on, I, I've got to, so here we go. Let's see how our long potting's doing. Not bad. Where's the white? It's okay. Six. It was a hard enough pot, but to get position as well. Don't think that black goes, does it? Oh, it does. It does. So if we can play a little cannon off, uh, off this red here. Just a little stun up into that red. Uh, we should be able to hold for the black. Tough little uh, cutback though on this red. That could set things up nicely. Oh, that's Seven. gone wrong. It's a disappointing shot. <sighs> He's got it all to do on his next. Never mind. We're going to have to play safe then. Play it around the angles. Hopefully get somewhere near the brown. That's pretty good. Pretty damn good. Yep. I'll settle for this start. Really wasn't expecting this. Safely in the ball. But this actually did really well on the channel uh, when we had it back in May. Um, and I always and did plan to do more videos. Green. And just on a whim tonight, I thought, why, why not play a little bit of uh, World Snooker Championship? So, expect... Uh, Reasonably regular videos on this, but uh, it'll be an as and when series. We'll play the double here. 
He pots the double oh, with a plot. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Goal for a high button. He did well. But look where we left the cue ball. We weren't leaving anything, so it was yes, definitely he... worth the try. And, uh, right in the heart of the pocket. It's a decent pot that puts him in a good position. It's a tough little black, though, to go around off two cushions. So, just have to, especially playing it with this pace. But it's gone in. Eight. We've got that red. He's just just past the black. On the next red. Back into this right corner the pocket. Then. Will he uh, get a nice angle on the pink? The only problem is we're not guaranteed position here because we are probably going to run into some of the reds. Unless we can find this little gap and maybe get out for the blue. They're talking about the pink, but I don't think we can hold it for the pink, so... Yeah, just try and hold it for the blue, and that's uh, worked nice. out fairly well. I we bought this, I think. I'll have to go for the yellow instead with the rest, which uh, in real life would mean end a break for me, because I'm absolutely terrible with the rest. But uh, we'll gloss over that one, play it with a little bit of right hand side here, and playing for one of those reds near the black. Eleven. Not quite hard it enough. Be too hard to get on the pink. And from there, the next red shouldn't be a problem either. So we've got a tough little uh, red here. Always uh, tough these ones into a half blind pocket. And there you go. But I think we've got away with it. You put got too away much with emphasis it. on the positioning and not enough on the pot. I think he's playing a plant here. Oh no! Oh, negative, negative play there. He's played that one impeccably. Can't really play He's it. Struggling up the a table. little right now. I just uh... oh, accidentally double tapped uh, X. It's pretty much the the shot I wanted to play anyway. So. That That's long fine. rest can be a bit like opening Pandora's box. Oof! Nearly fluked the red. Oh, nice safety. Well played. There's not really any tempt as there's this red here, but we're running into other reds. Um, I mean, we could easily pot it, but you know, I do want to have a certain element of realism on this uh, on this series but uh, yeah really really looking forward to the the new game coming out in the new year sometime um, you know my best estimate is uh, around with the Reds. April May in time for the world championship but uh, that was a poor safety from us so I wish we did take the pot now because uh, Matthew so Stevens sure as hell will you breathe a little easier now one he should be able yeah, to get first the angle look at the AI game. on the game, and uh, they are pretty brutal, especially There's the top players. You can go down here, and you know, in this sort of situation, I wouldn't expect Eight. Matthew Stevens to miss. So, pot, and he's well poised for the next. We'll just have a fifteen, a good watch of him here. But uh, yeah, that was a poor safety from us. I reckon he's got a good chance of being in position for another black. But yeah, the screenshots 16. look good. Apparently, they've got all yeah. 128 the players. On the I'm, I'm curious to see whether they've got Jimmy White because obviously he's never appeared on a, an Three. official snooker game before. So, um, yep, it was a great pot, and he got a great. It'll be interesting to see if he's on it. But uh, no, I'm really keen 24. to see what they do with it. Um, I'm hoping that's not just Ronnie in the final every. Uh, well, he'll be tournament or Selby or you know I hope there there is some variation in there players we'll can get beat on this I reckon and imagine Judd Trump will be overrated just as he is in real life one he'll be praying he can keep the cue ball under control this is nicely compiled from Matthew so far outside. I think he just got the wrong contact 38 and counting uh, could be seen our first century break of the match here. 
39. I really honestly don't expect him to miss. disappointed to be going for black again. The only thing that could possibly go wrong is a fallen out of position, but happens so rarely on this game. 46. With the, the top players. Of which Matthew was I back he's then. A good chance uh, of being in position for another black. He's introduced as the world number five. Got the final this year. Probably should have won it. Was ten six up thing, overnight, and uh, Sean Murphy came back to to beat him. Oh, that is a honest, surprise! Should have nailed that one. Wow. Which option will he plumb for? And now, here we go. Twenty nine points. Behind, One. this is where it wasn't we have to take our road, chance. So really, a better positional shot there. Nice pot on the black. Eight. It's not the best shot. Got one into the middle. The one near the black looks okay to me. But if we only score eight points from this, it really is a disappointment. Nope. Ooh. Nine. He'll be Did just fine in. if the cue ball doesn't misbehave. Now blue to the next red. Tricky, but uh, that looks just about 40. perfect. He'll try his damnedest to get nicely on the black. <laughs> Fifteen. I'm and pretty then, sure he's going to attack the black. How many times is uh, John Virgo going to say a requisite in this uh, in this episode? Answers down below in the comments. And don't cheat. <laughs> 22. Oh, that's nice. I'll probably play I reckon he's got a good chance of being in position for another black. Shouldn't be any problems here. Probably just screw back for the blue, in fact. Much easier to get on the yellow from the blue. 23. Well, that's a poor shot. Shouldn't well, have been this side of it. Here. Well, what are we behind? Six behind, so if we play the brown, we'll be two behind. Uh, so we'd need up to and including the pink. Um, but if we... Well, we'll play the blue. Leave ourselves a longer yellow. That was Because nice it should be blue. fine. A long pot is pretty decent, so you know, and it lends it itself up shot, nicely. But probably for, settle for it. Getting onto the green, we need to be high on the yellow to to be able to do that. So it's actually worked out quite nicely. Good shot. 30. Yep, he's Just got what he wanted to go. And drop this green in. That's not enough. 33. Oh dear. Those early nerves are settling nicely. <coughs> His action is firm but smooth. It's a disappointing shot. He's got it all to do on his next. He's not placed enough emphasis on positioning there. Good pot, mind. Tough brown. <clears throat> it's there though. 37. Well played. Very well need played. To see that one again. <clears throat> it was a tricky pot, yeah. but he's done okay considering. This is why I took the blue, because uh, if we miss the pink or don't get on it or whatever, Matthew can only tie. His opponent needs all the remaining points to draw level. He's just got nicely. to concentrate on the pots and put the ramifications to the back of his mind. This could be a critical Right in the heart of the pocket. 48. And a nice 55 clearance here to win the first frame. Basically nick it off Matthew Stevens. 55. He missed an easy black off the spot and we responded there with a lovely break of 55. And we take the first frame and we lead 1-0. So, good start for us. Has to be said. Now, how's our break holding up? Oh, this could be going into the pocket. Oh. Wow. 
slightly frustrating. Wasn't the best break off in the world. You want to you want to swing it closer to the pocket so that and get the other side of the blue so that it swings around behind pinned. the green. Oh, look at the black though. Well, he's playing a, a tricky one here, Matthew. Oh. Nope. He's missed it. He hasn't and settled yet. To hope he gets another chance that good. He thought too much about the positioning yeah, there. Got the angle here to go into this black and develop everything. Come on. So he gets on the scoreboard. He'll breathe a little oh. easier now. <laughs> Unlucky putting that red the there. The Otherwise, we would have probably took the black. But uh, I'll take the pink up into the top, I think. Um, which should be fine for us. Just sort of st stun it, and we've got that red over the in the middle. In worse yeah. ways. It's a nice shot. He <coughs> wanted to maximise his. The replay just shows what a sweet pot that really was. Yeah. It's a good pot, and he's well poised for the next. Probably going to struggle to get on a, a colour from that red, but. I guess we can screw it back for the blue. That could set things up nicely. I'll play it. Which option will he plump for? Right. I'm going to go straight into the pack here. Try and open things up, but uh, play it controlled. We don't want to go in off or anything. Developed uh, the one red and even put that, that safe, pretty so sharply there. I'd go for the position the pink. If he gets on the pink from here, he's in a good spot to hold for the next red. I'll just uh... fourteen. I think he fancies another go at the blue. Yeah, I think I do, John. <coughs> Screw it back. One of them reds on the top cushion. Nice. Nineteen. Not in an ideal himself. position, but he's still in with a chance. It's just been a really scrappy break so far, but uh, we're still potting. Yeah, you know, which is a testament to, to how, how we're, we're digging in here. Having the green now. Twenty. I'll tell you what, that it's might work point. in our favour because well if we go for the, the green, we might be able to play a cannon here. I'll touch a right hand side. This is a tough little shot here that we're trying to pull off. He hit the <laughs> red by mistake. <laughs> oh, well, it swerved it. Unbelievable. His opponent should have made that a little more difficult, I think. Now then, what? Matthew. He should be able to get the angle he wants from him. It's a good pot and thing. Four. So that, that's the shot we were trying to play. Not that little red out there. Those plants oh, are always. Oh, wow. Wow. I think suddenly looks that bit more straightforward. Nicely executed, as the replay shows. Nice it's a plant decent pot that uh, puts him in a. You'd have to say this is a great chance for Matthew. Eleven. He made light work of that. There's a few reds available. Decisions, decisions. Twelve. He can be on the red quite nicely from here. Tough green. Right in the heart of the pocket. Fifteen. I'd go for a position on the pink. Interesting shot. <laughs> You've never seen him play that in real life. It's a but, decent uh, pot that puts him in a good position. It's a game at the end of the day. That's <clears throat> 22. Nice shot with a pink. Now a test of cue in here. He on the rails who expected a better positional shot there. Shot. 23. Nice shot. He's spoilt for choice here. 
But he will just, just have that the blue. Miss Black lingering in the back of his mind here. The red will go, I'm sure of that. Nice shot. 29. I'm pretty sure. 34. He's left himself a long red again. Nicely. So he's 22 in front. Still plenty on the table, though. That was straightforward enough. Oh, nice pot. He's 35. pulled out a bill of red, which is very shot, beneficial he'll probably settle for it. Oh, he's playing the blue. The pink mustn't go. No. That just seemed a little bit... Missed the pot, but he had a decent like one shot too far, shot. and as you can see, the pink doesn't go. I think our first priority, though, as Ronnie's would be, get that black back on its spot. So we're going to play the cannon here. One. Yeah, that's worked out nicely. He's got to travel around the I table think. here. Ooh, it's thin. It's a thin shot. This might not go in. Oh, nicely played. Should have probably played it with a little bit Eight. of left hand side and it would have swung round for that then. red on the left hand side there. But he had to nice concentrate black. on the pot and he sacrificed position a little. Is he going to go for this red? Tough red. Really is a tough red. I hate these on the game. You can never quite tell with them. Just about drops. Nine. Which option will he plump for? Tough pink. I think that's what, that's what we're going for. <coughs> Try and play a stun, stun run through. We made light work of that. Fifteen. That looks. Oh, I thought that would. There's nothing Good. really shouting out at him. Hmm. He's left himself an interesting one now. Just hit this thin, try and get it behind the brown and yellow. Or in the pocket. Oof. Yep. That's Safe pretty good. He can be safe in the back of the bork. That had to be thin, and it was. Well played. So a little safety battle now. Only eight points in it. Nicely played. Doesn't really matter where the white is at this stage. There's a few suitable areas on the table where he can achieve a decent safety. Just go keep getting that thin contact on the red. Although I think he might have a snook it. He snookered him. The crowd yeah. like that. He'll try and get out of jail using the cushion here. Got to be careful. I mean, your instinct says play it like that. Try and get the flick on the red, but it's going to knock it uh, close to the, the corner pocket. This this is tough. This is this is uh, this is going to be difficult uh, to. To get out of and get it safe, you know that's the that's the thing you want to do. So we'll play it quite soft, and you know if we miss it a couple of times, it's not the end of the world. I mean that's absolutely miles. He off, had his so. back to the wall, but on this occasion couldn't acquit himself. It was about the the, the right line though. So if we can find that line again and just play it. A, a little bit harder, and we might have it here. And then, how's our look? Pretty good. I'll settle for that. That was a, a fairly good shot. Put too much emphasis on the positioning and not enough on the pot. Mm, nice safety. He's back in Bork and should be safe. I think, yeah, there's a path through to it. So, I'm going to go for this full-blooded. I'm going to try and cannon either the black or the red. 
the first points then after that tetchy little spell. Oh, not hard enough. That's worth the entrance fee alone. Let's have a look on the overhead. Are we on the black? Certainly Black's very difficult. Commission here. Blue's very difficult. The pink's even more difficult. The yellow's achievable. So is the brown. The brown would make sense because then you're not cannoning in anything. Swing it round off uh, three cushions for the red near the, the black and blue. Or maybe just the one cushion. I don't know. It depends how this bounces off. This first cushion. Ooh, I think we're going to cannon it. Five. Oh, unlucky. We might be able to pot it, but it's certainly very tough. A little bit harder, and that would have been absolutely bob on. Just didn't quite have the legs, did it? He's struggling a little right now. Just wonder if he should look beyond the safety here. Real tough shot. Really is a, a difficult one. With the rest, we'll play it with plenty of bottom so that it's almost with an element of safety. It should spin off the black and back to bulk. It's there though. Where's the black? Where's the black? Oh, six. Well, yeah, worked out quite nicely. He's got to Does travel black around go? the table here. Does the black go? That's the question of the day, everyone. Because if it does, this is uh, not too bad to uh, actually hold for the yellow. Just play it with tons of bottom here. <gasps> oh mm. dear. The less said about that miss, the better. Well, that's the end of the frame now. Dispatches the no yellow. Doubt about that. Two. It's a decent pot that puts him in a good position. Disappointing. Five. Brown and blue always difficult. I don't exactly know how he's going to get there. That's how. With that amount aside, that is an impressive Nine. shot. Yep. Just this blue. And Matthew Stevens will be back on level terms. That's the one he was after. Played it well. Fourteen. Played it well. Maybe the replay will give us an insight. He's done a good job here and can be a little easy for a while. He's dispensed with the pink nicely there. 20. Well, a nervy second frame. But Matthew Stevens is the one that clinches it. And he's back all square at one all. So what was a best of 33 is now best of 31. Good start this match. Wasn't exactly perfect, but he'll probably settle for it. If he can see anything better, great. But otherwise, he should just get back to the safety of the book. I feel like we're both playing fairly well. I think that will be a a good match. He's back in book and should be safe. Not quite the length I was looking for there. No. Half chance for Matthew, right in the heart of the pocket, and he gets a oh. lovely kiss on that red. That's worth the, the black. entrance fee alone. He'll be just fine if the cue ball doesn't misbehave. Eight. Played. That one might settle any nerves he's feeling. Nine. Nice one. He won't be too disappointed to be going for black again. He got the ball. 16. The red on the edge of the cluster must be a firm favourite. 17. Well, he's on a 147 here. The reds will Wouldn't be the first too. time. Is he going to go into the reds? No. Quite surprising. 24. The cue ball the just angle passes to the little side then. From that side, I think the pack would be lovely to go into. 
25. Great. That was poor. He'll try and get out of jail using the cushion here. He's trying to <laughs> get the pink. This is a really silly shot. I don't think that one will make it to the highlights. I hope that's a foul and oh. a miss. It's not. Unbelievably, it's There's not. nothing really shouting out at him. It's the one thing this game lacks is a miss rule. But I'm going to punish him for it. Because that was blatant cheat one. <laughs> right. <laughs> Just a little soft screw here on and off the cushion. Eight. Yeah. So, that one might set a little bit nerves. closer to the cushion than, than I would it's have liked. a decent pot that uh, puts him in a good position. In a, a decent position here to score some uh, fairly decent Nine. points. Again, Once again, the black's closer. probably his best <laughs> option. But uh, just stun it on and off for this cushion, uh, for this red on the left hand side cushion. Sixteen. Go into the red, but I think it might go past the the blue. If it makes sense to try for the yellow, and it does. So Too much emphasis placed on the pot. Got away there. with that. Most definitely got away with that. Little screw back here. It's there. Seventeen. He needs the cue ball to play ball, so to speak. Little stun run through here. Twenty. Hmm, I wanted a bit more than that. You'll be keeping one eye on developing the reds. Nice pop, but what about the positioning? <laughs> it's a big shot to take on. Because we're, we're bringing reds into play, but we're going to go for it. You know us. It's 25. there. That was a good Can't shot. see beyond the blue, to be honest. Blue's uh, tough, so I think yellow it is. I'll swing it round off uh, three cushions for that red just above the black. Oh no. We're okay. <laughs> How can just... you get onto the next red? It's going to take a precision shot to do anything with the cue ball here. What he Struggling doesn't want there. is for the cue ball to hit the knuckle. Just struggling to get onto something again to these reds. Played it well. 28. Got one more loose red. The pink looks now. like the best shot here. Tough little cutback on the pink. This might not go in. In offs on as well. Didn't look at that. This nope. could be a critical. Ooh, just went in. That and the pace helped that in. Won't be long before he'll be trying to bring a few reds out into the open. He'll almost certainly try to cultivate a nice position on the black here. Thirty-five. Again, just it's coming up short. Puts him in a good position. I think this red goes into the the left corner, or the well, the, yeah, the left corner um, from the TV view. So we'll just run through. The black goes down then. Forty-two. And when potting this red, we'll bring the rest of them into play. So the red that's just, just outside the cluster will surely go. It does indeed go. You know he might be running out of chances to get into the cluster. So I don't think we need to play this desperately hard, but with a bit of top spin. And look at that. Absolute perfection. 43. I think he's probably got the requisite angle to be nicely on the next red. We should win the frame from here. It's looking good with this fifty. Well, my colleague knows his snooker. Well, Another crack at the black to it now. This red Still will give him the, the right blue, angle yeah. on the black to lead him to his next red. 51. Not perfect. I think he's going for it. It's fine. In and out of bulk for that. Uh, he's got it. 
Right into the centre. 56. Well, you'd be disgusted with that as a player in real life, but it should be okay. Four more shots. Two reds and two colours. Just drop it in. 57. You can control the cue ball nicely there. This is frame ball. That's a tough one. Up against the cushion, under pressure. Frame ball. That one puts the frame right in the heart of the pocket. 64. Can we get the sentry? It's been hard work this break. He's taking the pressure definitely. off himself now. This will separate the men the from the work. boys. This right, I'll make sure Matthew stays in his seat. 65. So to speak. The black's looking like a good bet again. I just love these cushions. Must have a magnet to them. <laughs> right, so let's uh, screw that back. Oh, I've screwed it too much. It's looking good with this visit. Nothing special. It's fine, 72. though. 72. As long as you've got 73 by the time the, the colours come. Himself an interesting he one now. I reckon he's got a good chance of being in position for another black. Uh, might not reach. No. Uh, look at that, what a shame. In the unenviable position of needing... But that break of 78 gives us the lead once again. 2-1 here. So, our third frame, Matthew. That could have been a lot worse. Obviously, snookered himself. That is a terrible break off. He's and, had better uh, breaks, but I can't see any immediate danger. Matthew might be in the money here. But uh, he snookered what? himself. Uh, other than that, didn't do Wasn't anything wrong, else, really, in that frame. A better positional shot there. That one might settle any nerves he's feeling. Six. It's a decent pot that puts him in a good position. Oof. Seven. Which That's option will he plumb in. for? Twelve. Nice shot. Now then. I'm sure he'll Plays try and get onto the, the blue again. The second red of the three. He could have brought them all into play there, but decided to go a different. Thirteen. Approach and There's now plenty that tough could blue. Go wrong. He's got to be wary. He's already missed one of these. Oh, right in the heart of the pocket, though. That was good. Won't be long before he'd be trying to bring a few reds out into the open. Nice. Nineteen. Blue straight I another think pack. He's going for it. It's going brown, so must be a loose red in there. Twenty-three. Just playing How for the can he get onto the next extra row? four points. I can't see any easy pot there. It's a very, very perplexing shot from Matthew. But, uh, I think that red against the cushion will be giving one a little discomfort now. Over the over the pocket, so uh, that's uh, a really disappointing shot from Matthew in the end there. Now can we that was show him how to do Good it? Shot. One. Oof. It wasn't beyond the rails to expect a better positional shot there. It's a tough one. With the rest, this is a really, really risky shot. It's a good pot, and it's things might just start to open up in front of him here. How's our look? Six. I don't think it's very good. He's controlled the cue ball nicely there. Mm. There's plenty of reds that fit the bill. This one goes, but it's a, a tough little one to trickle past those uh, that that red over the pocket. But we'll go for it. It's there. That's beautiful. Seven. I like it. He should be able to get the angle he wants from here. Ooh, and now the black. We're gonna get the black back on. Ooh. Oh, it doesn't go. It probably would if we put a little bit of side on, but I'm not taking that those sorts of risks here. And we could. Uh, Get a two frame advantage over Matthew for the next episode, which I think is, is going to be really important. We played that nicely. 12. 
good position on the the red over the pocket. Nicely done. Well, it wasn't pretty easy. Pretty much to get guaranteed to be on it. Position. But, you know, you want to be in the best possible position. You've got to cue this nicely, though. Oh, played it well. 13. Played it very well. Spoiled play the choice here. Stun into this uh, little pack here. Doesn't have to be desperately hard, but controlled, and this could bring everything into play. And there you go. Eighty. That's worked out beautifully. He's got a pretty nice angle to nudge the black here. This is about Shut as simple up, as a shot as you could hope for. <laughs> he couldn't be more wrong. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to have to play it with Topman left rather than Botman right. <coughs> well, what do you. Oh! 90. I can't oh, see a way out dear. without coming off the cushion. This is tough. I mean, we can quite simply hit the black. Um, how do we get safe? I mean, maybe just a little bit aside. It's tough, though. Definitely tough to hit. Well, what's happened to the air? Uh, What's happened to the um, the line? Oh, that's back for the uh, the next shot. He got the red there. That's a foul. We hit the red. Oh, we hit that perfectly. Foul. This could be a free ball. He's going to pull us back. Going to have to pull something <laughs> out of the bag to get a pot here. Oh, well done, ref, for getting it back perfectly. I guess we must must have just hit this red in front of us, but uh, we'll try it again. He didn't afford that one enough. <laughs> this time we've planted the red in. Oh, look at that as well. Oh no! Is he going to make try play? his damnedest to get nicely on the black? Playing the pink. This is a big shot for Matthew. Oh, right in the centre of the pocket. One. Beautiful. Can he get himself nicely on the black? Is he on the black? I think he's probably got the requisite angle to be nicely on the next red. Oh, nice shot. Eight. Will he get a nice angle on the pink? So. Nine. Good chance here for Matthew. On? Fifteen. I don't know, hold out much hope. That good pot. <coughs> Where's the cue ball going? <laughs> 16. There's so several uh, rolls 34 he's ahead. Here. Still uh, 59 on the table. Make that 39, so. 21. He put way too much colour red, it'd be enough. If my math serves me correctly, and he's too red. Twenty-two. Yeah. He put a nice bit of side pink. on it there. And then the next round, oh, he's playing the blue. This is a very odd shot. <gasps> How? Mm. The less said Why? about that, miss, the better. He got the positioning well. about right, but missed the pot. I mean, this is the second frame that uh, we could potentially steal from. Matthew here, I think uh, first port of call is to develop this black. We know we've got the, the blue waiting for us. One. Mm, There's a couldn't chance went much worse, that. that good pot. Didn't want to move the black onto the cushion. And uh, left ourselves a, a pretty difficult positional shot, but it should be fine. As long as we miss the cannon on uh, a ball uh, colour. Oh, 
I bet you the blacks covered that pocket. That was a nice blue. <laughs> oh, dear. He's got some decent mileage off this blue. The one near the black looks okay to me. Well, I would never in a million years have played this, but they're certain that this goes. So... We'll play it. And it did go. Good eyesight. Seven. From the boys in the box. There's several roads you can go down here. It's uh, a tricky little blue, but uh, should be okay as long as it reaches. As long as it reaches. Oh no. Oh dearie me. He's missed the pot. And Matthew just needs this red now. <gasps> oh, and his doesn't reach. Oh, the if tension. The table, he's won it. Wow. He got himself nicely on the next, but missed what was admittedly a tricky pot. Now then, you need black or what? pink here. Blue I'm pretty good sure enough. he's going to attack the black. What a big frame this could be. We've both had massive chances to win this. We're the ones in the driving seat now. What a miss from Matthew on the blue originally. Eight. Nice pot on and the black. That red just too soft. He's missed a few easy ones in this little mini session, so... He's definitely going to go at the mid-session interval, disappointed. Yeah. Like, it could potentially be 3-1 down. He's but got it all to do on his next. We've got a tough little uh, green here to come. You feel, though, if this goes in, it's end of frame. <gasps> I thought we'd missed that. I 13. thought we'd missed that. Nicely played for the position, though. Pot, but to get position as well. The blue just about cuts in from... Uh, Brown yep, spot, so brown. just hold it's it a there. Decent pot that puts him in a good position. Maybe play for this pink in the that middle. That was a pretty good shot. Twenty-two. That's not gone. It wasn't his best shot, plan. but he'll probably settle for it. But pink to black is okay. So just screw back, play confidently. And it's in. 28. And now the black. Roll down to this black then. To steal a frame that definitely shouldn't have been ours. It's there. What a brilliant comeback in two of those four frames. And we take a lead at this mid-session interval at 3-1. And that is where we're going to leave it for today's episode. If you have enjoyed that, then please, please, please leave a like down below. Really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. Subscribe to the channel for regular snooker content. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.